dun, 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 That's a seat off of there, boy. Ah, we did it. Uh, uh, uh. We did it. Uh, uh, uh. Hey. <laughs> What's the last one? Detron did this. I like that one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Detron Does It. Of course, I am Detron. Behind the camera is my wife, Arielle. And we bought a bus, like a real bus, not like a baby bus. 14 passenger, it's got a mechanical lift. Somebody 65 or older should be driving it, kind of bus. And now we're getting ready to tear it up. The focus is removing the seats. I came through a bit earlier today and sprayed some WD-40 on all of the bolts. Luckily, the way this bus was put together, it is bolts and not rivets. So we shouldn't have a very difficult time taking the seats out. I say shouldn't, but we also don't know what we're doing. So we could be here all night, honestly. This is part one of many parts of a shuttle bus to come as we get ready for a new business venture, which we'll talk about a little bit later. All right. You guys ready to tear some stuff up? Let's move some seats out. Honey, mm -hmm. show them what we got. Show them what we got. Let's do this. Du, 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 du. That's a seat off of there, boy. Ah, we did it. Uh, uh, uh. We did it. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, hey. No YouTube tutorial necessary. I mean, but if you're watching this one, don't feel bad, though. <laughs> we still need those views. Yeah. So this side is. Oh, a nickel. <laughs> this side is a lot easier to take off. There were two bolts holding it into the side rail. There was one holding it down here. And then there were two, if you could see, there were two that were inside of this track. So once we removed those, the seat popped right out, which is not the same issue that we have on the other side. The other side, these bolts actually go through the floor and have nuts on the other side of them. And they are rusted on pretty good. So it's taking us a little more time, but I have to put a little more WD-40 on these to get those out. And these are the ones on the driver's side, but it looks like we're probably gonna be able to take these passenger side ones out tonight. Let's go, two more rows. So we have to get underneath because the seats are attached underneath. So I am holding the wrench while my wife is up there working the socket wrench to try to loosen this thing up. All right, go ahead. Thank you. 